This is Gene Key, KDDD News. A Canyon man is dead after an accident in Randall County. NewsChannel10.com reports the Department of Public Safety says 26-year-old Chase Schult was driving on Farm to Market 168 Sunday morning when his car veered to the right of the roadway. He then overcorrected, causing the vehicle to skid into the ditch. Troopers say Schult was not wearing his seatbelt and was ejected from the vehicle as it overturned twice. He was pronounced dead at the scene. The Hank Skinner execution has been postponed. According to ConnectAmarillo.com, Texas' highest criminal court postponed the Skinner execution because it's examining changes in state law concerning DNA testing. Skinner contended that new DNA testing would show that he's innocent. He was convicted of murdering his girlfriend and her two sons in their papa home back on New Year's Eve in 1993. Prosecutors say the courts have already ruled on Skinner and are contesting the new test. According to them, Skinner's trial attorneys previously chose not to use the test as evidence because they feared it would damage Skinner's case. A man is charged with capital murder in a 13-year-old case. According to ConnectAmarillo.com, a man has been charged with capital murder in a 13-year-old case in Canyon. According to Canyon District Attorney James Farron, Gerald Ross Dooley was charged Friday for the death of Fred Mosley. Mosley, just 17 years old, went missing from Canyon in July 1998. Dooley is accused of strangling Mosley during the robbery. This is Gene Key, KDDD News.